for the record, please introduce yourselves. Um, my name is Idana Kadener. I am 20 years old. I'm a Filipino Dutch, and I'm currently in London. And she's awesome. Yeah, she's. <laughs> Who are you? Hi, I'm Bianca Yuzon or Yuzon. I'm 26, and I flew in from Manila just to be here. Okay. So tell us about the event that you're participating in. Right, so it's called The Great Escape. It's an international music festival that's held annually in Brighton. There's also a music convention and um, acts and artists from all over the world come to perform. So they, it's done like Coachella style, but it's the whole city that participates. So different venues, some by the beach, some in different mm -hmm. bars. Mainly highlighting upcoming artists. I think. Upcoming yeah. artists. So uh, what do you want to showcase as solo talents? I think the fact that we are, I would say, hoping to become very established artists, it's just an opportunity for us to kind of just showcase what we have done, all the work that we've inputted, all the singles that we're trying to release, and we just want to see like how everybody reacts to to what we have to offer and I think it's a great platform to start for us because I mean I'm like newly fresh into this industry and I'm just like making my way um, but I think just when Bianca sh when Bianca messaged me the other day being like we got we got the show we're going I, I screamed like at the top of my lungs I, I had no idea what to expect but oh I was like God. I'm ready you know I'm, let's go and I booked my flight that day made all these plans and by God's grace we're here and I'm like going in without any expectations but just expect the best mm -hmm. um, but I mean it's just so surreal like we I think oh that's gonna be our favorite word for this surreal. Trip. It's so surreal like we're the first two torture artists to have the opportunity to perform abroad and I think as a starting label that is a huge step and we're, I can say for both of us we're extremely honored to be the two um, very blessed yeah. but yeah of course the responsibility is now in our hands to make a good representation of what is back home um, and hopefully we do do that and I think we will. And we're not just the first two Tarshir artists to represent our label no. at ABS-CBN, we're actually the first two Filipinas in mm -hmm. the history of this whole festival so that's that's mm -hmm. huge, it's such an honor mm -hmm. and I think that as you know whatever genre you define us by I think that as artists it's just such a it's so great yeah. to be able to participate in something like this. Mm -hmm. Do you apply to that um, event and how do you get shortlisted? Um, technically, I think that the other acts have applied for this, but yeah. Autonomy Music Group and Talyard Studios have invited us mm -hmm. to perform here, so it's, it's an honorary invitation. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Um, for both of you, how would you describe your music? I love this question because so if I'm going to be completely honest with you, I don't think that there I have drawn a boundary to to a specific genre, and because, um, like I said, I was so newly fresh to this industry, I'm still exploring. Um, but currently, what Tarsha is doing is um, we're mixing. We're we're taking a huge pot of music and just deciding. Oh, I want a little bit of this. I want a little bit of that. Um, let's see what happens. And currently, I'm currently working on um, electric dance music or EDM, which is currently very, very popular and I find myself really enjoying this but I'm even delving into more R&B to mm -hmm. um, soul, to a lot of jazz, to so many things and I love Tarshir because in that sense we're not limited, you know, we really get the opportunity to just expand what we, what we look to, I guess, become as an artist. Definitely, too. it's very um, collaborative, I mm -hmm. would say. And on my end, I, I used to be in a rock band. <laughs> I came yeah. from theater, so I've kind of <laughs> been around. But uh, right now, I would say I'm focusing on indie electronic. Mm -hmm. There's always that nice electronic element when yeah. you're dealing with Tarshir artists, and it's nice because we come from different backgrounds. So I think it makes it relevant to everyone at the same time. Yeah, like you don't exclude a single group of individuals because. I think nowadays everybody does listen to everything mm -hmm. and they're open to everything so this is the best time for us to come out here and be like, hey, what do you think of this? Yeah. Or, um, yeah, we've got yeah. a bit of rap. Yeah, we have. We've got like Kyler doing rap, we've got Marcus doing, what does he do, r and Everything. everything. <laughs> yeah. So, okay. And why is it important for artists, mus musicians like yourself to be um, participating in an event like this? 
Well, that's why we are so passionate about the message that Tarshi Records stands for, because it's about taking Filipino music to the global stage. Mm -hmm. We believe that there's so much talent out there, especially in the Philippines, and mm -hmm. this is giving us a platform to do our thing on the world stage. And mm -hmm. it's, it's really important because we need to cross boundaries, we need to break barriers through music and art and creativity and I think that's the best way to kind of reach out to other nations mm -hmm. and even so peace. yeah even so like grow as artists take every opportunity and learn from it and gain experience and from that I think you really just mature in I mean your your, your music your talent your gift and I feel like Tarsher is really we're really banging on everyone's door and being like, listen to what we have because we know it's worth your time. And I feel like this opportunity itself just encompasses this this mentality that we share because, Definitely. again, it's so surreal. Like it was always been a dream of ours. Like we, Bianca and I have been talking about it since the day we met. You know, yeah. Like one day we're gonna get there and An like, international music festival. Yeah. It's insane. It's, it's insane. <laughs> oh, we're gonna see. <laughs> like act it up. <laughs> Um, what are you gonna do? Okay, so I've been performing this, my first single. Um, I'll be performing that on Thursday, and that's what I've been doing a lot in Manila as well, in a lot of our um, Tarshir performances. And it's a song about love. <laughs> um, what's new? You know, every teenager's dream. So, uh, actually, it's about heartbreak at the same time. So, it's a mix of both. But I'll give you a little uh, snippet. And if you want to join in, because okay. she knows it by heart. So. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm confused, unused by you. I can't choose what to do when I see you. I'm screaming at the top of my lungs, begging for serenity to come. Wiping away all my tears, trying to see all my fears to keep you. Bum, 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 bum. It's just friction, an addiction. We're hiding. We're hiding. We're hiding. It's just friction, an addiction. We're fighting. We're fighting. That's that's my go. That's <laughs> yes. And on, so this is feathers. Is there anyone out there? Need a witness for these crimes of classic betrayal, mute and neat, on with a smile. When he held me, he spoke of our future, strong and bright. And we talked till dawn in the languages of flesh and mind. Goblets of red wine, feathers in my long hair. We built an empire with the keys to a city hidden plain sight. Our love was double-edged, from strength to a weakness. He fashioned a weapon, a weapon. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Ayan, talk to each other. Do you want extra small? Because I didn't know this one. Did you give me the one with the one there? They all have shelf. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, because when Marcus was like, Tear <laughs> <laughs> This is like music. Yeah, yeah I know what I'm doing. There's no way. Okay, maybe I'll be Wait, why? How old are you? 20. Brittany, I was like, And then Michelle was like, Yeah, you know what? It's fine. And you, you'll get more. He's blowing up. He is super. He joined the eggs. Did he win this? Mutiny done with a smile Screaming at the top of my 